Hey everybody, this is Dee Halleck again from Scenario Arms and the X7OG.net. Just wanted to show you our newest little invention that is, in my opinion, awesome. Um, it's a Betamag, C-Mag, drum magazine. Replicates the kind that are popular in modern video games, Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, um, SOCOM, a bunch of other first-person shooters. It's a high-capacity 90-round drum magazine that is used on modern assault rifles and like machine guns. Now, what we've done, you guys have seen this on our web before, it's for the X7, has a nice uh, imprinted text, restricted law enforcement, government use only. Also has um, Aim Top International stamped on the front of it. And we've had this for a while for the X7, but had an idea this past weekend and um, tried making a mod for it. Works really good, so now, this drum magazine is going to be interchangeable with the Tipman Phenom. Between the Phenom and the X7, you can swap it back and forth with the use of one adapter. So, as you can see, we have our X7 adapter on it right now. Hold on with the screw in the front, screw in the back. Now, right now, here's what it looks like on the X7 standard. Gives it a nice light machine gun look, high capacity for all the heavy gunners out there. Gives it a nice intimidating look, especially to the newbies. And doesn't have any function, it's just for looks, cosmetics, makes you feel cooler out on the field. Um, one complaint people have when they've never really used one before is they think that, well, you're going to be a much larger t target, you have this protrusion from the side of your marker. It's really not the case. Where when you have it shouldered in a game and you're firing, you can see that if there was nothing here anyway, if a paintball comes by, you're still going to get hit. This doesn't really present any larger of a target. I mean, it doesn't matter if this is here or not, you're getting hit if a paint comes through that area. So, right now it gives it a nice heavy gunner look. Now, let's say that middle of the day, you don't want to use your mechanical X7 anymore, you want to use your Phenom. Pop it out of the X7 standards magwell, get your screwdriver, Phillips head, when you're in the parking lot between games, refill in your paint or air, and just remove the screw from the front, pop out the screw, take out the screw from the back, nice and easy, and pop out the X7 magazine adapter. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take our Phenom magazine adapter, pop that in place, right on the front, replace the two screws, first the back one, or the front, doesn't matter, now put the front one in, and now, we have our X7 Phenom adapter in the mag. So now we're going to take our Phenom with our 5.5.2 setup and we're going to put beta mag right inside. Now your Phenom has the look of a light machine gun. Gives it a nice cool look, once again, for the heavy gunners out there. And interchangeable back and forth between the X7 standard and the Phenom. And we will be offering um, on our website, you could buy just the beta mag, you could buy the X7 adapter, the Phenom adapter, or both, or all of them as a kit, whichever you'd like. Pops in and out. Then if you want to go back to your regular standard X7, remove the two screws, put in the X7 adapter, you're good to go.